What's up, YouTube? Probably bringing episode 12 of my Ann Carter Shortstop Road to the show here on MLB The Show 16. And in this video, we will be facing off against the Generals, who are the double A affiliate of the Chicago White Sox. And as you can see, it'll be the start of May. And in April, Carter batted 415 and 77 at bats. No home runs yet. But eight RBIs. So really, really, really good, impressive first month of professional baseball. And we will settle into the batter's box. One out. Runners on first and second as we swing past that pitch low for strike one. And it'll be a base hit, pass it the second baseman, and that will be a single. Everybody will move up, runner will score, other runner will move to third. So, right off the bat, Carter continues his hitting streak and gives the Bay Bears an early 1 0 lead. Next batter in an 0 2 or 1 2 count. And that's strike three, so two away. Here in the first, as Brett Hayes, the catcher, is up next. Who to count? Let's see if he could expand his lead a little bit as he hits that to deep left field. Warning track. But left fielder is under it to retire the side. Bay Bears score run, or one run. Really cannot talk right now. Anyways, bottom of the second, tied up one run apiece. Feeling opportunity for Carter. Ground ball right to him. We're going to throw onto first. And a good throw gets him one no problem there. And with that, Slowly but surely getting better at the field and not botching as many ground ball chances. So, Glove is coming along nicely, as so is the bat. That's found on the first baseline. Only thing Carter's not doing is hitting for a power, which right now is not too bad. But base it right up the middle. Single number two of the day. Okay, so another base hit, and I believe last time I looked at league leaders, Carter was first in batting average, which makes sense. He's batting over 400 as he goes to steal second, and he is safe. Mostly because the shortstop, I believe that was, he didn't have a clean glove on that throw from the catcher. And there we go, everyone will be safe. We move up to third on the ground ball to first. But he's up once more. And he could get an RBI here. As he failed to do so in his last at bat, but he walks. Second walk he surrendered here in the first. That will be Sean bring up third Carver baseman Sean Carver. Base is loaded. Still no one out. So let's, let's see what he can do here as he strikes out. Alright. General pitcher. Fully sure that he's getting out of trouble here in this inning. Benito Reyes is up next. Playing second today instead of Arias, giving him the day off. That'll be a grand ball up to second. Throw on the short. Back to first, and that'll be an inning ending double play. Generals get out of any further trouble. Right. Bottom third. 3 2 count. Another fielding opportunity for Carter. It's not sure why he didn't dive there, but... Okay, so runner gets on. Right. Next fielding opportunity is one batter later. Or, no, two batters later, actually. Ground ball, ball right to Carter. Flip on the second for some reason, and... Everybody's safe. Yep, that was definitely a poor throw decision. 
and because of that, general take a 3-1 lead. And now, bottom four, nobody outs one on. Ground ball, right to us. We could probably throw it a second that time, but it's okay. We get the runner out there. Pretty much just as I say, we're getting better fielding. We kind of make a couple bad throw decisions, but again, that's why we're in the minors to get that all worked out. Ground ball to second, takes himself, throws on the first, and that will retire the side. Alright, we will be down 5 to 1 here in the fifth. Carter up for his next at bat, one out. Use some showtime. Swing this. Strike one. That was just a waste of the showtime feature there. As we somehow missed that. And Swainrest strike two on a curveball. Nearly right down the middle, the same spot as the first pitch. Now we hit right to the glove of the left fielder. We made solid contact. Down six to one. Bottom of the seventh. Runners on the corners, no one out. Full count. Let's see if we can turn another double play here. Ground ball to Carter. Throw on the first. Runner will score from third. Not much else we could have done in that situation. Move on to the top of the eighth. We're down six runs now. We have a runner in second. Nobody out. Carter dribbles that in front of the mound. Pitcher overruns it. We'll be safe. The runner gets to third. And we do get tagged out, overrunning first on that little base running blunder. And what's this? Aiden Carter was replaced due to injury. Great. Just what we need. And it will go to the end of the game. And I believe we lose. Yep. 8 to 2. We do go 2 for 4 with an RBI, though. But I just want to see what the severity of this injury is. Um, I'm really hoping we're not out for too long, but let's see. Get out of this. You sustained an injury, shoulder soreness. This is a minor injury, so you will not be placed on the DL, but you will be forced to miss a few games. Okay. Could have been a lot worse with overrunning first. Don't know how exactly we hurt our shoulder, but we did, But and we will miss the next game couple games again we're batting 420 as you saw right there and 81 at bats like 9 or 10 RBIs we're gonna upgrade some stats a little bit we are 61 overall B potential so on that note I'm gonna end off here if you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like comment share subscribe all that fun stuff and I'll see you all in the next video